Let us say I have bound the bots to my Binance, which I did in the last presentation. What I will simply do is to come to this mine, this is my profile, and click on it. And once I click on mine, the next thing I will need to do is to click on assets. Click on assets here. Mm, here. So I'll click on this place to expand it. Now you can see theory options, deposit, withdraw, or transfer. Now, so to deposit, I will just click on this place to deposit. Now this is a unique um, USDT wallet address. So what I need to do is I just simply copy it. Now let's copy the wallet address and go back to my Binance because I need to fund this um, bot with about $120. 100 for the activation fee. Why 20 will be for the fueling fee. So I'll come to Binance. I don't really need this um, API. Let me even delete it. So, um, okay. This was the API I was doing in the last video. I react you to delete. I don't need it. So, so I'll come back to my, this is the homepage of Binance. I'll click on wallets. So now I'll click on USDT. I want to send USDT to that wallet address. So I'll click on withdrawal. And I'll paste it. Just to, I'll press it down to paste. So I'll click on paste. So if it's 120, for example, I'll send, on, send 120 and I'll click on withdrawal. So the one USDT is the network fee. So I'll click on confirm. So these are the normal verifications before you withdraw. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> So before you withdraw, um, based on the settings I use, I would need to send, they need to send me a verification to my phone number, a verification to my email, and I need to use my Google Authenticator, like you saw in the former video. After that, I'll click on Submit. Now, once I send the money, okay, once I send the money, it comes directly to my Rare Q wallet. So here, I should be able to see about 119 dollars so i should be able to see 119 dollars here after doing that the next thing i need to do is come to activation here activation here it is activation and i'll click on activation so once i click on activation next thing i'll click on this other activation and boom welcome to real q trading bots you have registered the only next step now will be how to set your trades. So, well, usually, okay, let me check if this would be open. Now, usually, you need to be, you need to use the professional edition to be able to trade all the currencies that are available on Binance. So, what you simply do is click on this place, click on professional edition. Oh, not again. Okay. So, there's an option here. Simply click on I agree. And then click on start now. And they're going to ask you some questions. So simply just usually the B's are, or the last ones are usually the answers. Just no need. You can just follow it. Then theory B. Then you click on submit. I doubt if it will work since I've not even activated or done anything. But usually after activating, it should work. And once you submit, you'll be able to use the professional version. Meaning when you come here, let's go back. It's because I've not activated, I guess that's why the, where the problem is coming from. So meaning when you come back to quantify here, after doing that, you come to this place. Um, since it's my network. Okay, my network is unstable. Let me pause it till I have a good network. Okay, the network has stabilized. So what simply happens is when you come here, you can search for any coin. For example, let me type, type Matic. Matic won't show because I've not activated that professional version. But after activating it, let me even see if it will work again. Professional edition, I agree, start now. B, B, C, B. Let me see if it will work. I think that was because the last one was because of the network. Okay. It has worked. So let's come back and try it again now. Let me want to search for Matic. So you can see Matic already, meaning I'm using the professional version. So after this, you can now start trading. So the last video will be on how to set your trades.